Literally looks like it was manufactured today on the inside. Look down in there. No rust, no pitting, no watermarks of any type. Just smooth, clear metal. Look at that. What's up guys, this is Brian again from Lake Hickory Scuba and Marine. If you are new to our channel, do me a huge favor. Hit this little subscribe button right here and ding that little bell as well. Well, you guys are going to be notified every time we upload new content. I got Mr. Ian back here. We're doing some visualizations on several tanks that's come in. We've had to get them hydroed. And of course, we're doing the visits on them now. But I want to show you a tank and I want to show you just how long your equipment will last or you know how good it will still be in the future as long as you take very good care of it. So Mr. Ian here is working on a Steel 72. This is a 1977 model, Steel 72. Uh, we can see, and I apologize, it's a 1973, not 1977. It's a 1973 model. Uh, it just recently got rehydroed in 7 of 22, so this month in 2022. And I want to try to show you inside this bottle just how pristine it looks. It literally looks like it was manufactured today on the inside. Look down in there. No rust, no pitting, no watermarks of any type. Just smooth, clear metal. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. It's probably one of the cleanest Steel 72s that's still around today. This tank has been taken very, very good care of by the owner. Um, yeah, it's a really good, good looking cylinder. So guys, I just wanted to make this quick impromptu video for you to, to basically state, look, we need to take really good care of our scuba gear. If we take good care of our scuba gear, it's going to take really good care of us. And this is a prime example of how well you should keep up your cylinders. It's rare that we get an older tank that looks that pristine on the inside. Sometimes we'll have a little bit of flash rusting. We typically see some pits or at least rust marks going down the sidewall where you've got moisture in it. Maybe it's laid on its side or whatnot. But this tank is perfect. Externally, cosmetically, it's got a little bit of stuff on it. We're going to scrub off for the gentleman. But internally, this tank is in absolutely perfect condition. So I wanted to show you that, guys. I wanted you to see just how well or how long scuba cylinders will last if you take good care of them. But I hope you liked today's video. If you did, give me a big thumbs up. Definitely share it as well. As always, make sure you follow us on Instagram and Twitter. Like us on Facebook. Pin us on Pinterest. Subscribe to us here on YouTube. And as always, guys... We appreciate your business.